but I couldn't. That's okay. What the hell? I'm gonna put my finger. Can you guys say Happy Easter? Happy Easter! Happy Easter! I have my finger. Mom. It's delicious. Mom! Don't eat it. Don't eat it yet. Yeah. <laughs> 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 How are you supposed to do it? Eggs, don't eat it. It's okay if you guys mix them in at all. Oh, okay. Mom, can I eat my mix a pan? In. Yeah. We okay, can do use that. some more eggs there, <laughs> Yoshi. Like <laughs> Here's our finished product. Turned out pretty nice. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to the channel, Trinity Dairy. I've um, got something a little different for you today. Uh, we're going to chop a little corn. We're out here in my grandpa's cornfield. There's uh, four rows left of corn here that got left for uh, his crop insurance. So we're just going to chop them off for just some bedding. Um, I could run the stock chopper through here, but I thought I might as well use them. And then we got, we're going to put Paul's 560 to a little bit of a test. I got our old Gale 400 chopper here. Uh, with a two row head on it. We're just going to chop it into the old wagon for some bedding. Um, I was going to use the 790 New Holland on the big tractor, but I wanted to try this 560 out without having to switch the electronics and stuff over. Um, this chopper, basically I wanted to run this. I wanted that head to get ran and oiled some just because that's a really good head. The chopper's not much. And after the shed caved in, it got banged up, so it's probably not going to sound real great, but um, anyway, so we're going to try this out and see what this 560 will do.
to see how it went. bedding chopper because it chops long. Perfect for cornstalk bedding. Oh yeah, nice little pile of bedding in there. Yeah, that'll be... Calves will like that. Now he's going to want to chop all the corn. <laughs> well, I figured the next test will be that uh, flail chain spreader. That'll put a load on it. What gear were you in? Two? You pull it down then for the hill? Yeah, I probably wouldn't have to. I just have to work this much. All right, well, we'll head this home and make a video. It looks like the Easter Bunny made an extra delivery from a couple of friends of the kids. Looks like they got a bunch of goodies. And they got some new church clothes. <gasps> what did you get, Jesus? Yeah, a, a bubble lawnmower. A bubble lawnmower? Yeah. <laughs> you like it? What the heck? He like, what did you get? By the way, he was pushing it around, y'all. What did you get? A Disney princess kite and a pit and a horsey painting. And, painting and, right and I got a gun. Cool. And but I got, I got a Jordan gun. gun. Just kidding. <laughs> Hey, what's all in your book, Justin? So now these goodies here, these ones weren't from the Easter Bunny, right? Yep. Who were they from? Mom. Joe and Martha. What do you guys tell them? Thank you. Joe and Martha. <laughs> what is, did you guys find your Easter basket? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Can yeah. I eat my egg? And Mom, mm. we all got cookie. egg and cookie kit. Oh. That comes with Candy and icing. Ooh, look at that. Cool. Uh, one like that. One like that. Jess. As soon as the bubble comes out. Oh, my God. 